Okay, kids, I know how you always wanted kittens, so guess what I brought home? This very pregnant, about-to-burst, distended nipple street cat. <laughs> Gather around close. Her name is Sophie, and she's fully dilated. <laughs> Trish, she doesn't like that. But I understand the instinct. Now, we all need to do our part to help with the birth. Meg, boil some water. Brian, get some clean rags. Chris, blankets. Dewey, band-aids for me. Isn't it nice that we're spending this time together as a family? Well, look at us, out for a fun family dinner. If anyone's watching, they'd say, look at that family. Look how happy they are. Well, the kids do love fun ruckus. Yeah, getting the design any burger you want? Your only limit is your imagination. What kind do you make there for yourself, Chris? Plain. Plain? What do you mean, plain? It's a plain burger. Fun ruckus? What, what part of fun ruckus don't you understand? All of it. All right, let's start this again. You're all going to get up. Go back up to that Toppins bar and go nuts. But it tastes good like this. It's not supposed to taste good. It's supposed to look crazy. What the hell are you doing? I'm cutting it. It's easier to eat. It's not supposed to be easy to eat. Half of it is supposed to fall onto your plate when you split them on. Salt shaker? Whatever. Ice from soda? Get on that burger. Peter, people are staring. Yeah, they're saying, look at the creative guy. Look at King Fuddrucker over there. Usually you put a burger on a tray. This guy's putting a tray on a burger. Are you through, Peter? Not yet, I'm not. Give me the car keys. Peter. Give me the car keys. A car. Good. That's also Fuddruckers. Get used to it. And prepare to fish my teeth out of my stool. Peter, enough. You guys clearly don't get it. Well, I'm sure when you explain what we're supposed to get, we'll get it. Those poor kids. Those poor babies. Hey, Chris, what do you got there? You love your family. You can do this, Peter. You love your family. Dad, can you crack your window a little bit? I hate you all so much! Uh-oh. I see that. The bunny rabbit family you just ran over? Yeah, we all saw that, Peter. Uh, come on, kids, let's go inside. Board game, which I quite enjoy. Okay. And Meg, I'm sorry I'll never get a chance to walk you down the aisle at Costco to furnish your sad single lady apartment. Thanks, Dad. And Stewie, it kills me that I'll never see you become a man. Loving Twink. Is anyone gonna stop him? And Chris, whenever you're feeling... You're a dog. Peter, what's going on? Why are you saying these things? Sorry, why don't you guys go inside? I'm going to stay out here and listen to Nina Blackwood slowly die of throat cancer on the radio. Our next artist first climbed the charts with Dancing With Myself. <sighs> of course... Th yeah, I guess so. It's weird. For the first seven days, all I did was create things. But since then, it's just killing, killing, killing. Well, go ahead and do it. My family would be better off without me. I'm a terrible husband and a terrible father. I should never have questioned you. You were right about everything. Not about being good or bad. It's just blind subservience to an imaginary being. So, I'm not gonna die? Nope, not for another four years. Thank you, God. Bless you, my child. Pornography fan. Aha, you did it to me. Can I use that one on my son? Sure. Hey, Chris, you like pic- Well, sorry about Fuddruckers. It won't happen again. Because nothing means more to me than my family. Oh, Peter, that's wonderful. What helped you come around? Well, Lois, let's just say the big man upstairs put in a hard day's work today. Well, looks like quitting time. 